Welcome to Susanna for Home Cooking. Today I will make the famous braised pork belly. Pork belly is very, very famous, very popular dish among the Chinese. It is original from Shanghai region. The pork belly is braised slowly until it almost melting into your mouth. In this recipe, I will use about two to two and a half pounds of pork belly with the skin on. Quarter cup of soy sauce, one cup of Saoxing wine brandy or whiskey, four ounces of crystal rock sugar, one small piece of ginger, one teaspoon of clove, five whole star ends, two sticks of cinnamon, and four to five cloves of garlic. First, I will cut the pork belly into about two inch by two inch square pieces. Use strand to cross tie the pork belly. This will tighten the pork belly and keep the layers from separate when you cook the pork. Blanch the pork in the hot boiling water until it turns slightly firm. Then remove the meat and drain the water. Place the rock sugar in a heavy cast iron pot with a half cup of water. Bring to a bowl, then turn the heat to very low and simmering. If you cannot find the rock sugar, you can also use the cane sugar to substitute the rock sugar. When the sugar is totally melt, add the pork and rotate until the meat is totally coated with the sugar. Take it out, put it on the plate, and the pork should have a slight shine to it. Add a two tablespoons of oil to the pot. Then add the garlic, star onions, clove, ginger, and cinnamon. Then add the brandy and soy sauce. Bring to a bowl, then turn the heat to low, add the pork back into the pot, and cover it with tight lid. Then turn the heat to simmer and cook the pork about two and a half hours. After you cook for a while, add a scallion for a little extra flavor. I like to add one tablespoon dark soy sauce for the color. Turn the meat every half an hour or so, so it make sure all the meat are covered with sauce. Move the pork belly out from the pot and strain the sauce discard the spice and skin of the fat. Add the sauce back into the meat. This will make the meat more flavorful. Then you can place the pork into the refrigerator to harden before you slice it. Otherwise, it will fall apart. There are so many ways you can serve the pork belly. In a traditional Shanghai restaurant, they would serve one piece of pork belly with vegetable underneath and pour the sauce over. But you also can serve as a Chinese appetizer with a steamed bao bao layered with slice of pork belly, tomato, cucumber, and jalapeno pepper. Also, the non-traditional way you can serve with a taco, which is wonderful, layered with avocado, pork belly, tomato, jalapeno pepper, and lettuce. I hope you enjoyed this meal. You can always find the full recipe in the description below. Happy and healthy cooking. See you next time.